Good Monday morning, I'm meteorologist Ted Schmidt. The beautiful, stellar, sensational weather we experienced over the weekend continues today. If you liked what you had Saturday and Sunday, which is basically about as good as it gets for August, uh, you're in light today. It looks like a terrific start to the week, and we're really going to slowly ease our way up the ladder a little bit. Uh, middle of the week, latter part of the week, it's going to be a little more humid, so there will be changes ahead, but really, by and large, a long stretch of some really great uh, summer weather continues. Uh, all you could really hope for. Now, the one think we all could use is a bit more rain. We had some of that a week ago uh, and it's going to be a few more days before we even get a chance of rain. And there's not going to be a whole lot, I think, one even that does arrive later this week. But right now, I guess we'll take what we get and what we get is a terrific sun-filled blue sky Monday. Here's our quality group camera from CC Heights right now on just a few minutes before 8 o'clock this morning on this beautiful Monday. Hi, meteorologist Ted Schmidt again and again, talking about a lack of rain. Yes, we have a deficit right now officially up to date. I'll look at the number here. It is 7.57 uh, inches below where we would normally be for the climate standards. So we are way off the mark. That is a lot of rain. We are below average. It's about two months worth, again, as I've been saying. So yes, that would be nice to have. A little bit of rain would help a little bit. And we do have that in the forecast, but it's about four and a half Five days a week. It's, it's going to be about a Friday night, a Friday evening at this point. So, uh, for that, uh, with that going on, we're looking at day planner today and our Monday. Like I said, it looks like a terrific day. High of 80, a slow, uh, 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 decent uh, uh, light breeze anyway, a light amount of humidity in the atmosphere. Uh, sunset coming up at 8 12, and uh, we warm up uh, actually fairly quickly from the 50s to the low 80s this afternoon. 54 right now, uh, just before 8 o'clock here in Rochester. South winds light. Dew point 52, very crisp, dry atmosphere. And again, that's not a permanent uh, feature in our weather, but it's going to be here for another day or two with uh, a subtle change in that mugginess coming up later in the week. 54 right now in Rochester, 61 in Winona, 53 in Mason City. Satellite radar, not a cloud in the sky and no rain chances nearby either. We have a storm system for the northwest that eventually will raise the chance of rain. That in its cold front will trigger some storm chances again Friday evening, Friday night. And we have another one maybe late Sunday as the pattern gets maybe just a little busier for next week, but that's quite a ways off. Right now, high pressure is anchored nearby. It has not moved at all, really, in about four days, and it's been giving us the same weather as a result. Every day the same, and, uh, and I have not heard one complaint so far about that. Now, tomorrow, Maybe a little more of a south breeze in the uh, western periphery as that high pressure as it gets out of here. Uh, winds up to 15 miles per hour. High temperatures, low 80s. And then mid 80s start showing up by the time we get to Wednesday and Thursday. And by then, also a little more humidity. And by the time we get to late Friday, there's that chance of thunderstorms feeding on that extra humidity that will be in the atmosphere. A little extra instability. Not necessarily widespread severe weather or wide, heavy rain event, but at least a chance of rain that comes up again late on Friday. Today, 80 degrees in Rochester, 83 Mason City, 82 in La Crosse. A lot of sun. Just a hint of a south breeze around 10 or 12 miles per hour. Tonight has been the clear, a low of 60. And tomorrow, 82. Most of sunny, just a bit warmer, a little more of a breeze, maybe up to 15 miles per hour. Uh, outlook for the middle part of the week and really the latter part of the week. Chance of thunderstorms Friday, late, more than likely, it's going to be an evening event. Uh, mid 80s, Wednesday and Thursday, heat indices approaching 90, though. It's that rich humidity. It does come back for a couple of days there and then drops off after that cold front moves through on Friday. The weekend looks pretty good. A couple of late day thunderstorms, more than likely Sunday evening, while a lot of sunshine throughout the weekend ahead of that. And high temperatures very seasonable in the low 80s. Looks like we'll be in that range much of next week, upper 70s, low 80s in the upcoming work week with rain chances toward the middle of next week. Could be late Tuesday into Wednesday. And that's, again, uh, more than a week away, but looking down the road at more rain. We could use and uh, there are about four chances in the next two weeks <laughs> so something down the road in the meantime enjoy today's terrific monday sunshine monday's uh great temperatures too and i'll see you right back here for tuesday